This video is homework help for solving to find the missing angle measures. So this is not the actual homework, but this is an example. And you can look and see and say, oh, I see this box right here for this angle. This box always means 90 degrees. If I look, I have these straight lines. I have this straight line here that's 180 degrees because we know that a straight line is always 180 degrees. And I have this line that is 180 degrees. And I know that for angles that add up to 180 degrees, so ones that are supplementary, we could do this right here. I'm just going to take a piece of paper and cover it up. So these three angles add up to 180 degrees. So I have one angle that measures 90 degrees. And I know that again because of that box. I have another angle that is given to me that is measured 50 degrees. And then I have this measure that is 2x. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to take 180 degrees and I'm going to subtract 90 and I'm going to subtract 50. And what I'm left with here is 40. So this measure angle measure here itself is 40 degrees. But we also need to know what is the value of x. So it says 2x equals 40. So we can set up a simple one-step equation, 2x equals 40, to find the value of x. So I might say, okay, the two numbers smush together. That means multiplication. The opposite of multiplying is to divide. 40 divided by 2 is 20. So for this, I'm going to uncover this now. It says, what is x? x is 20. So we have half of these angles now labeled. We have this 40, this 50, and this 90. So what we need to do is we need to look at this other these other spots and fill them in. We learned that vertical angles are equal, they're congruent. So if you look, this 40 degree angle is directly across from this 40 degree angle. So we can add 40 here. Okay, and now we know we don't need to do anything else with the rest of these angles up here, so I'm going to cover them up using my, pen, my paper. We know that this is a straight line that is 180 degrees. So I can take and I can do some simple math. 180 degrees minus the 40 that we already know and labeled will give us this unknown angle measure. So 180 minus 40 is 140. So that means that this angle measure here is 140 degrees. Now, when I uncover it all, if you look, we have all of these angles now labeled. And this is the goal for this homework assignment. Fill in all of the angle measures and then tell me what is the value of X. Please feel free to rewatch this video as many times as you need to help you with this homework. I hope you have a wonderful evening.